you know, working hard, you know, everybody wants that title. But let's get down to brass tacks here, Olympia style. Who is the biggest threat to your title tomorrow on that pre-judging stage? Is it the man sitting next to you, being the only guy that's beaten you on this panel? Is it the gift to Bill Heath? Is it Kai Green, Branch Warren, or anybody else around here? Who do you see as the number one threat to your title? Um, it was funny because I was just sitting here and I knew you were going to ask me that question. As soon as you put the mic down, and uh, I already had the answer for you. And a lot of you guys have been coming to Mr. Olympia for years, and you see, you know, 22 competitors up here. Of course, last year I was number one. Um, this year, that means nothing. It's it's all anyone's game that's sitting up here. Um, it's all who's going to be laying best tomorrow night and Saturday. Now, as far as the best contender. There's a lot of guys that are contenders, but I'm going to give the prime example of why I'm going to answer this question. Um, when I was coming up through the ranks, I, I was 8th place in 2000, and my first Miss Olympia in 1999 was 15th out of 16th. I was fortunate to move up to 8th the next year, and then in 2001, I wasn't a contender to even be in the running. I moved from 8th to 2nd place to Ronnie Coleman and almost won the contest. So, realistically looking at it, there's anyone can win this competition um, and it's all who you stand next to and I've done what I had to do to be you know similar to last year I can't say what what I'm gonna look like to, um, tomorrow night or Saturday you know I just know that, that right now you know I've, I'm feeling strong about it and, and you know I welcome the challenge and I wish everyone the best and, and most importantly that everyone gets on that stage healthy tomorrow night and Saturday night and we put on a great show because that's what you guys you came here for. And of course, a lot of you guys have fans. I mean, of course, Dexter wants the title back. I know Phil wants it back. Kai Green wants it. There's a lot of hype. Bob, you're, you're king of the predictions, so maybe you can answer that question. Who's my biggest challenge? I don't even think you've had me win in the contest, so. Okay. So, as far as predictions, I mean, you guys, you guys, Came here to see a show, you're gonna see a show, that's what I'm gonna give you guys tomorrow night, okay? Woo! Jay, you, uh, you certainly gave him a show last year. You came out absolutely on fire last year with purpose, with attitude, you had command of that stage, but you had something to prove last year, not just to yourself, but like you said, to the fans out there. Do you feel that same sense this year, or is it a different feel? Um. I just, you know, I had a great thing. I mean, I had a great uh, team behind me last year and all of the years. I mean, I had the fire and the drive and, you know, bodybuilding is one of those unique things. I mean, I picked up a magazine when I was 12 and I wanted to be a bodybuilder. And I think you're either born with heart or you're not. And a lot of people, you know, train with the heart and the fire and the passion. And if you didn't have that, none of these guys would be up here competing. And, you know, we talk about who trains harder than who and everyone has their own styles. and you know, we kind of fall into our own groove, we do different things, and, you know, everyone's talking about how they're working with this guy this year and that, you know, f finding new routines to follow and, you know, either successful or not. You know, we all find a system that works, and I think, you know, that's what competition's all about. It's all about trial and error and just being the best you can be. And I think, you know, I found the system that seems to work best for me. Uh, I know people question my motivation. Um, they see me out, you know, guest posing around the country, trying to do what I do. And you know, the the true thing is, is, is I'm very driven, I'm very focused, and uh, I just I'm here to do my job, and that's to win. That's it. Thank you, Jay.